Over the last few years, there's been a lot of debate among Hog fans about whether the games here at War Memorial Stadium should continue or not. Many say they want to keep the tradition going. Others say the home games should just remain in Fayetteville. But when you talk to Chad Morris and the players, they're excited to play under the lights here on Saturday night. You know, I haven't been at a Little Rock night game in forever. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm really excited to go down there and, you know, see, you know, War Memorial under the lights again, go down there and experience and play in front of my family and friends. Um, just to be able to experience that one last time. These fans have shown us great support. You know, they, they know we're progressing. We're getting to where we need to get to. And um, I feel like that they're noticing that and that the turnout in Little Rock would be great. To be a part of it and to be standing on the sidelines of where history has is, 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 uh, uh, been created, I'm, 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 um, I'm, I'm extremely excited to be a part of this. And I look forward to the loud, um, excited, rowdy environment that uh, – that we know that our fans are going to be out and in full effect and ready to go to support these hogs. Now, hopefully we'll see the same Razorback defense we saw two weeks ago against Texas A&M and not the same defense we saw last week. They gave up 65 points to the SEC's top offense in Alabama. Now, Arkansas will go up against the SEC's number two ranked offense in Ole Miss, a squad that has averaged almost 60 points per game in non-conference play, but has averaged just under 12 points per game in their 0-2 conference start. Either way, John Chavis and his defense will look to contain Jordan Talamu, as well as a good group of receivers, led by the top receiver in the SEC right now in A.J. Brown. Ole Miss's receivers are fast, but we're talking about guys that are 6'4", 230 pounds. And they're bigger, they're, you know, they're stronger, uh, so uh, hopefully we can get enough people around them to tackle them. These guys are very talented. They're they big bodies, you know, and they do a good job running the system and catching the ball, very strong receivers, you know, so we have to be technically sound and we have to be able to tackle well on these guys. I feel like he's as good as any of the other quarterbacks, if not better, in running the ball. I feel like if he wants to, he can get 100 yards rushing each game. Kickoff coming up at 6.30 here at War Memorial Stadium. Of course, we'll have a whole lot more on Fox 16, not only tonight, but throughout the rest of the weekend. Reporting here in Little Rock, Ben Creighton, Fox 16 Sports.